All right, so today we're going over websites you can use to earn money by solving math problems. If you're someone that likes to do math and you want to start making some money doing it, I'm going to show you a website that's going to pay you up to $30 per hour just for solving math problems. So let's go ahead and jump straight into this video right now. Yo, what's up guys? It's John here and welcome back to another one of my videos or welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, I post a weekly content showing you how to make some extra money online. So check this out real quick. If you're someone that's ready to escape your nine to five job, if you want to work from home and become your own boss, I want to take a quick second to invite you to hit that subscribe button. Again, I post a weekly video showing you how to start a side hustle straight from your computer. So basically making money online, making money playing games driving around testing websites you're gonna find a lot of great content inside of here that's gonna help you make more money so you can finally escape that nine to five job so let's jump straight into this video right now and again subscribe down below for more great videos let's jump straight into this one so all you're gonna have to do to start making money by solving math problems is go over to google and type this website in right here people per hour so peoplepersour.com it's going to be the first link that pops up. Go ahead and click on that. And so what people per hour is, is a freelancing website. So people can come on here and post whatever work they can do. So if you're someone that likes to write articles or if you're someone that likes to create videos, you can come on here, create your own profile. <clears throat> And people can hire you for, to become a freelancer for them so to make their video for them or to write an article or write a paper for them or do mathematics for them start solving math problems for them so all they would have to do is come to people per hour inside of the search bar right here type in mathematics after that all they have to do is click on find your expert and they're going to see a whole bunch of different profiles of people that can help them out with their math problems so as you can see right here this one charges 30 dollars per hour just to help them with mathematics this guy charges 10 bucks per hour 30 dollars per hour they'll start seeing profiles of people that can actually help them with their mathematics skills so all they have to do is click on one of these profiles right here and they could start seeing more information about the person's profile so for example obviously his name and more about what he does right here so he's been he has a quick response usually available 24 hours a math tutor all levels of university and you know step-by-step -step solutions to solve math problems so just get more information on the person their job exactly how things are going to work and once they're ready to uh, hire them and you know get the job all they have to do is click on buy now and they can go ahead and get started with this so what you want to do to start making money solving math problems is create your own people per hour profile just like these people have right here and as you can see right here check this out there's not a ton of people doing this right now there's an overall maybe about 12 or 13 profiles so you can be the next one by creating your own profile and start offering your services on people per hour again you can charge anywhere between 10 to 30 dollars per hour just to help them solve math problems so to sign up just go back to the home page right here go to the top right hand corner and click on become a freelancer right here where it says freelancer with a question mark after that click on i want to work as a freelancer and sign up using your email or your facebook account that's fine right there and all you're going to do is just go ahead and fill out your name fill out your email and after that you're going to start the application process to create a people per hour profile and so as you're filling out your application you're going to specify the exact work you want to do on people per hour so obviously helping people with math a math tutor and once you go ahead and submit the application one of their moderators is going to review and approve your application once you're approved you can go ahead and create your profile and start taking any job that comes your way inside of your back office you can also submit jobs or you know request jobs that are inside of the back office guys so it's an easy way to start getting more jobs inside of people per hour now the trick to getting more jobs and you know getting more work on people per hour is really developing your profile so if we go back over here you're going to see that this person right here obviously doesn't have a ton of development with their profile you know it has two little lines right here doesn't even have have many pictures so you really want to make sure you develop your profile you know add in a lot of details as much as you can of what you're going to be doing on the job you know that way people get a better idea on what you can do what you can actually help them with and they're going to want to hire you more you know it's more likely that they actually hire you someone that has a more professional profile as opposed to someone that kind of has a few little details here and there you know one single picture so you definitely want to make sure you 
add in as much info as you can to your profile so people can get a better idea on what you can help them with which will give you a better chance to getting hired now once you go ahead and get hired for a job what's going to happen is the buyer or you know your client is going to make the payment to people per hour people per hour is going to hold on to the payment in their escrow once you complete the job and you help them out with their math or you know you complete the job overall people per hour is going to go ahead and release the payment to your account now that's after the person that you know after your client has approved the job you know if you do good work and you know they like the job that you did they're going to go ahead and approve the payment after they approve the payment again it goes into your people per hour account which later on you can go ahead and redeem using your paypal account using a pioneer account or using your own bank account the payment method is up to you you have three different options paypal pioneer or your own bank account so again it's really easy to do guys just come on people per hour and create your own profile so that's website number one <laughs> excuse me i'm running out of breath a little bit that's website number one website number two is called fiverr.com guys and it's it's basically the same thing it's another freelancing website where you can come on here create your own prof profile <clears throat> and start you know accepting jobs to help people with math so all someone would have to do is come up fiber.com type in mathematics and after that you know different profiles of people that can actually help them with their math will pop up so all you have to do is create your own profile sign up to fiverr create your own profile and your profile will pop up right here just like all these other people's and you can start accepting any job that comes your way. Again, the key point here is to go ahead and develop your profile, making sure that you know your profile stands out amongst other people. That's what's really gonna make you, you know, help you start getting more jobs as a freelancer. And it works the same way. Once somebody hires you for a job, they're gonna submit the payment. Fiverr holds on to the payment in their escrow. Once the job has been completed, they release the payment to your account. Now with Fiverr.com, you wanna make sure you do ask for a review after you complete the work, after you complete the job, because obviously reviews really matter a lot. You know, when somebody new comes and checks out someone's profile, if they have, you know, close to a five-star review, it's a lot more likely that they hire them for a job. Now, one thing I like about Fiverr is that it kind of gives you a better uh, basis on building your profile right so if i click on become a seller right here so if you want to start you know create your own profile and start doing these type of jobs click on become a seller right here you can get some more information if you start scrolling down but go ahead and click on become a seller after that it's going to take you through you know filling out your application exactly what you want to be putting on your profile to start getting more gigs and more jobs so click on continue you know overall gives you a lot more information on building your fiverr profile then you know exactly what you should start putting on it then you know how to start standing out from other people's profile so continue that with that right there and then you can get started with the application process right here just fill out your name add a picture of yourself right here you know add in a description of who you are exactly what type of work that you do and just your languages click on continue and you can go ahead and get started with the application process to create your profile guys so that's an easy way to start making money doing math online solving math problems it's just becoming an online freelancer you know anybody could hire you as a math tutor or anybody can help uh, can hire you to help them solve their math problem algebra geometry calculus whatever you specify or or whatever you're an expert in guys so again this website right here is called fiverr this one's called people per hour so just create your profile and sign up now just for making it to the end of this video right here guys i want to give you a free gift in my description down below i got a free ebook that i want to give you that goes over how to get started with affiliate marketing you know honestly doing something like this you know helping people with their math problems is a cool way to make some extra money right but you know obviously you're not going to make any money unless you're working with somebody or unless you get hired if you want to start learning how to build passive income online basically you know start making money while you're on vacation start making money while you're out eating while you're sleeping guys it's called really building passive income if you want to learn more about that then just click on the first link inside of my description you're going to get taken over to a free training video where i show you exactly what i'm doing online to build some passive income i've made anywhere between 500 dollars to even up to a thousand dollars in a single day just using my computer guys and i wasn't even really working you know i was honestly just waking up or i was out with my family at the park guys and it, again it's something called building passive income if you want to learn how to build passive income again click that first link in my description and that's it for this video guys if you're ready to become a freelancer and start making money just for doing math problems then just go to people per hour or go to fiverr.com and create your profile today hit that subscribe button down below if you got some value from this video smash that like button for me and i'll see you guys on the next video